We find a scene where people are bringing their children to Jesus in hopes that he might touch them. The disciples, however, rebuke those bringing the children, perhaps thinking they are protecting Jesus' time for more important matters. Jesus responds with displeasure at his disciples' actions and insists that the children be allowed to come to him, declaring, Let the little children come to me, and do not hinder them, for the kingdom of God belongs to such as these. Jesus then takes the children in his arms, places his hands on them, and blesses them. This passage highlights Jesus' openness and accessibility, especially to those who might be overlooked or undervalued in society. It emphasizes that the kingdom of God is open to everyone, irrespective of social status or age, and highlights qualities found in children, such as innocence, dependence, and trust, as essential for those who belong to God's kingdom. Jesus models a welcoming attitude that embraces all, particularly the least and the lowly, illustrating a profound reversal of worldly values. Applying these lessons today, we are called to reflect on our own attitudes towards those who are vulnerable or deemed less important by societal standards. Are we, like the disciples, creating barriers or are we, like Jesus, welcoming and affirming their worth? Children often symbolize the broader category of those needing patience, attention, and care. Jesus' welcoming of children serves as a reminder to value and prioritize these traits in our interactions with all individuals. In what ways can we become more welcoming and inclusive in our communities, particularly towards those who are often marginalized? Dear Heavenly Father, we seek the grace to receive your kingdom as little children do. Teach us, Lord, to embody the humility and trust that Jesus valued so profoundly in the young ones he blessed. Guide us, O oh God, to be agents of your welcoming love. Help us to lower the barriers we unconsciously erect against those who seem less significant in the eyes of the world. Instill in us a spirit of inclusivity that mirrors the example set by your Son, who showed us that your kingdom is made up of such as these. Lord, in our daily interactions, let us not overlook those who are vulnerable or marginalized. Grant us the patience to listen, the wisdom to understand, and the compassion to act kindly. We ask for the courage to challenge societal norms that dismiss the least among us, choosing instead to affirm the inherent value of every soul. As we endeavor to walk in the footsteps of Christ, teach us to cherish simplicity and sincerity in our faith journey. May we approach you with the pure and trusting hearts of children, confident in your love and guidance in every aspect of our lives. Bless us, Father, with the ability to see your face in every individual, especially those who depend on us for guidance, support, and love. May our actions and words reflect your goodness and mercy, drawing more souls into the embrace of your kingdom. We thank you for your endless patience and unfailing love. With grateful hearts, we offer up our prayer, trusting in your divine plan. Amen.